Welcome to Outdoor Gear and Gadgets, presented by Michigan Outdoor Obsession. Welcome to another episode of Outdoor Gear and Gadgets, where we review all the latest outdoor gear on the market today. Today we are going to review the Nordic Legend Aurora Ice Lodge. This thing is a monster. But before we get started, let's show you how we got this thing set up. All right, guys, this is the Nordic Legend Aurora Lodge. This thing is a monster. Check this out. We have six windows on this thing. And look at this. This fabric is heavy duty. This is not thin stuff. It's extremely heavy material, durable material that's not gonna rip on you. A lot of heavy uh, seams here. And it, it just does not look cheap at all. One feature on the outside here, on each of these points, on each of these sides, you have your anchor here, and then you have a little pocket that has your tie down. Easy storage, just put it back in your little pocket so you don't lose it when you're done, done for the day. Just look at that thing, man. That thing is a monster. And up here, if we look, we have our built-in chimney port. You can bring your own wood stove, little mini wood stove inside this. If you don't want to use uh, propane, you can burn wood on the ice or out for winter camping. You will not see another hub line that has that feature. Now just so you know, this thing does come with all the anchors you need to anchor it down. Like I said, all the anchor points are already built in right here with the straps right there, ready to go. We got two doors here, high quality material, high quality zippers. Come inside here and look at this thing. Look at the size of this thing. This is, I looked up the stats today and I looked all around. This is the biggest hub fishing shanty on the market today. Out of all the brands, you will not find uh, a hub shanty with more fishable area. This has 115 square feet of fishable area. Right here we have 80 inches to the center. So unless you're a giant, you got plenty of head space in here. Um, you cut over here, we have six of these windows with these insulated covers. All around here, you got a window almost each side here. Like I said, we have two doorways. We got this door guard and what this door guard is, a lot of times, you know, when you put a shanty out, you get that tension from just having it strapped down. And this right here is how you relieve the tension in the strap right there to help so you don't wreck your zipper and your zipper isn't hard to open up. We have a storage area up here to store some of your stuff, maybe some of your hats and gloves while you're out fishing. Over here we have on each side here and here, we have rod holders built in and a little storage area. So everyone in the shanty has plenty of space um, to store their goods while they're out here fishing. And here is what I showed you earlier, the built-in chimney port. You can, like I said, you can put in a little mini wood stove if you don't want to burn propane out there. You also have on each side some good ventilation ports here. So if you guys need some air, air flow in your shanty, on both sides, you do have some ventilation ports. Now, just to give you a better idea, it is 11 and a half feet from side to side, and from corner to corner, it is 13.3 feet. That is enormous. Now, this is a six to eight person shanty. Um, and another feature I wanna show you guys, you see the silver material. Now, you haven't seen these in a lot of shanties. The silver reflective material helps keep your heat in. So you're not losing it out. I mean, though, not only do you have the thickness of the material holding the heat in, you have the silver reflective material, which does not let the heat leave the shanty. 
Um, when you're out there in those really cold sub-zero days, um, you're not going to be sitting there losing a bunch of heat. Quality, durability, um, stuff that's effective for out in the fishing world, things that people have thought about that said, man, I wish the shanty had this or that. It's really got everything you could think of um, if you're an ice fisherman or if you're just a winter camper and you want something you can take out in the woods to do some winter camping. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. Let your friends know about outdoor gear and gadgets. We will bring you latest gear that we come to. As soon as we get it, we'll put it up here on here so you guys can check out and make a wise decision on what's best for you and your family. Thanks again, and we'll see you soon.